Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Kayla for those who do not already know. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and become part of my YouTube family. And without further ado, let's get into today's video. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make this super delicious cheese ball. So this cheese spread is super easy. You only need four things, which is beef lunch meat, Philadelphia cream cheese, green onions, and Ritz crackers. I make this every time we have a family barbecue or a get together. I also make it just to have around the house and to snack on. So let's get to making it. So the first thing you're gonna do is to get your beef meat and you're just going to take it out of the package and slice it up into little pieces. And it's totally up to you how small you want the pieces. You can make your dip a little bit more hearty so that it's more of a mouthful. But I just cut them medium size. I don't like it too small and I don't like them too big. And I get this meat at Kroger's or Walmart and I get this little bag only because it is about 97 cents and this is all you're going to need to make this cheese ball. Once you get your beef cut up you just go in with your green onions and I'm going to give these a good washing before I start cutting them. And I like to go in and cut off the tops and then I'll just use this part in the middle and you're just gonna do the same thing with the beef just cut you little bite-sized pieces totally up to you if you want them really chunky or if you want them really small Now that I'm done cutting up my beef and my green onions, I then get my Philadelphia cream cheese. And I've had it setting out for a little bit only so that it softens. I'm just gonna cut this open and then I'll cut it in half so that I can do it in sections so that I don't have more than I can handle. Also, you're gonna need a storage container to keep this dip fresh so you wanna make sure it seals tight. Now it's time to start adding your beef and green onion to the cream cheese. And again, this part is totally up to you. You can add as much as you'd like or as little as you'd like. And you can also go in and add bacon bits just to kind of mix it up a little bit. And that's also super good. So we love our cheese ball to be super chunky. So, we put a lot of green onion and beef in it. So while I'm still mixing this all up and adding, I just wanted to let you guys know that this is a super good entree. It's amazing just to have around the house. You can have it at baby showers, birthday parties. When you have guests coming over, you can set this out with a little plate of crackers and a little knife. This is always served at our Thanksgiving dinner table. My whole family loves it. I can eat a whole bowl by myself and so can my sisters and my mother. Now that I'm done, I'm just going to clean up and I'm going to put this in its container and then I'm going to give it a little taste test just to make sure I don't have to add anything else. And if it's good, I'll just put it in the refrigerator for about an hour and then I'll get it out to eat it. So I just wanted to share this video with you guys. Maybe you can try this and you'll like it. It's great to pack for your husband's for lunch or even your child.